Hey, what's going on again, guys? Be sure to like the video if you laughed, comment your favorite part of the video down below in the comment section, and be sure to subscribe as well, too. Let's get the subscriptions up for this month. Let's dive right into this. So for a long time now, I thought I had some pretty shitty dates. Well, apparently not. What possibly could absolutely go wrong when you meet somebody on a dating app, right? I mean, we've all done it. Let's be real here. Well, apparently for this poor Massachusetts woman, she ended up being accomplice to a bank robbery. Who knows? So this epic date started all when a girl had to drive her of Maxima to go pick up the guy she met on a dating app. I'm gonna say that again. A girl met a guy she had to go pick up on a dating app. Hint, hint, nudge, nudge, wink, wink. That means if you have to go pick the guy up for the first date, the dude ain't shit. But hey, by the way, Nissan Maximas, they're pretty nice though. So this chick goes to pick the guy up inside a Nissan Maxima. Mind you, these people have never ever met before besides talking online. So, you probably think this sounds really sketchy. Newsflash, this is very, very sketchy. Why? Here's why. She picks the dude up, and the dude's sitting in the passenger seat drinking a bottle of wine. By the way, I'm pretty sure that's legal in Massachusetts. But hey, the only reason why you drink alcohol in the middle of a date is because, well, either one, you're gonna do something real stupid, or two, you just don't like who you're about to have sex with at the end of the night, pretty much. But things get good when homeboy leaves her in the car for 10 minutes outside a parking lot of a plaza. Mm. According to the police report, homeboy came sprinting out of the bank, sweaty, with a 44 pistol, a hat, sunglasses, and saying, Step on it, get the fuck out of here! Oh, and while saying all this, heaving with sweat, the dude's got a thousand dollars with him. He robbed the bank. For a thousand dollars. I could've worked a whole week for that. So what do you do if a female and a guy scream and fucking go? You go! And that's exactly what this chick did! Low key though, this guy must've been so happy that he finally found his body to accompany his Clyde. Anywho, this is going on in North Attleboro, Massachusetts. If you're not familiar with North Attleboro, Massachusetts, there's literally nothing that goes on there. So, you know, bank robbery, pretty big deal. Also, too, just another side note, the 44 pistol the dude had on him was his grandfather's. So not only was this guy in the past seat drinking wine prior before then and had a girl come pick him up for the first date, he also stole his grandfather's pistol. Like I said, dudes ain't shit. Unfortunately for this poor young fellow, the girl decided to stop as soon as she saw sirens coming up behind her because she had no idea what was going on. Not only did this chick stop the vehicle, she got out. She walked out of the vehicle. The man was ripped out of the vehicle by police officers, but it gets better. For some reason, I think the man might have had too much wine because he was spitting all over officers as they tried to pull him out of the vehicle. It's not too good in life when you have a grown man's wine spit in your face as a police officer. If it was me. I would have gone for the fireball. Just saying. Things didn't work out too well for the uh, man there. He got sentenced to five years in jail. As for the girl, well, you know, she was clueless. She didn't know. She actually got away with no charges. Not bad. Well, that's gonna do it for today's video. So uh, be sure when you meet these people online, you might want to do your screening. You know, maybe a pre-FaceTime or something before you actually go meet these people. Ladies, if you have to go pick a man up for the first date, that probably means he's not the one, sister. But anyways, that's going to wrap it up for today's video. If you laughed at all, chuckled at all, be sure to like the video. Subscribe to be able to keep up with all the videos I'm releasing every single week. And with that being said, peace.